What's up everybody, it is me King Alpha, I hope all of you guys are having a great day and I am very sorry I haven't been doing content, um, on Saturday I will be leaving back to uh, Br Florida, I was about to say Brooklyn, I'm going back to Florida on Saturday so it's going to be a long flight for me and everything, uh, if you guys didn't know I've been in Wales this whole time so if you haven't noticed I've been posting about like 5 hours ahead as usual or streaming really uh early in in US times and stuff so you know just be prepared for that and everything but I've enjoyed my time like crazy in Wales and I was over here for almost 6 months and it's just been amazing. Uh anyways, so actually going into the video. So today it was a 1 million death rally on a fort and if you guys didn't know pass five did open this is just uh me actually clearing out the area right before the rally actually went off um sadly the audio in the stream for some reason when i downloaded it it didn't want to work and it's kind of stupid because um you know there was a lot of cool moments that i was talking about and everything and i just would have loved to just been able to use the, the actual stream audio instead of having to actually talk the whole time through this whole video. Um, additionally, I want to say this. Uh, I do hate low quality mode like or simplified graphics a lot in this game. The main reason is, is because, you know, yeah, you can click like and see who's uh, basically the commander or something like that. You can see it. But what I would prefer is if like it just showed like more cat, like if it was like solely cat, like just half size it or something, not just the commanders, because I'm not going to click every single commander just to see what it is. And if I'm using infantry, I obviously want to target cavalry players and stuff. I don't want to hit archery players and etc. So yeah, it's a, it was just one of the things that I were personally just disliked about it. Um, Additionally, I will be showing the report again at the like at the end of this like big field battle and everything. But as you can see, Attila is currently already hitting the Richard and it is doing so much damage. This uh this actual uh fort was filled up with I think about it was like it was maxed out so 2 million troops and or 1.5 million, I don't know how many was in there, but I know they did reinforce it and holy crap when I tell you someone even lost almost 500k troops alone on this so a big thing is for old kingdoms in a way and kingdoms that actually have had mge with attila and, and they can get it expertise and everything it's kind of crazy like attila and takade so it's kind of crazy that this era like this meta right now for this game it's 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 just crazy wild because Attila and Takade is very strong. Wu Wu Zitan is super strong as a defense uh, hero as well. Now the issue is sometimes uh, Attila and Takade actually beat Wu Zitan, and then sometimes it doesn't. I really think this all depends on you know reinforcements, how many reinforcements it, it you know the rally is getting. Uh, same with the defense. If the defense is getting more. Um, what what is it? Reinforcements, uh, commander skills, etc. Was for some reason I've seen a lot of uh, for for sorry I, I've seen a lot of Attila's sometimes actually not even do the damage that I've seen on other rallies when in reality they are expertise both that some people even have both of the heroes expertise and are doing even more damage than even this rally did. And sometimes they just don't. So I kind of wonder whether it's the fact of, you know, commander skills. If the people that are using Attila and Takare, if their Attila is actually having the wrong talents that aren't, you know, supposed to be on it. And I would love to do maybe a talent tree for Attila, but I personally don't have Attila even. So it really does suck. And I would love to do those type of guides and everything in the future when I have accessibility to them and everything. Uh, additionally, I do have another rally video. This was actually really crazy. It was a trip rally on uh, a big player in our current kingdom in 1111. And it was a trip rally on him. And he actually did really well. He only lost, I think, about like 3 million power. And it was 
pretty good. Like, you know, when it really depends on how you defend these big rallies. And sometimes <clears throat> it's just crazy to think that sometimes it can be good if you defend with the right care, like the right heroes and everything and all of the actual skills, talents and everything that come into defending. It's 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 always tested like it always needs to be tested and it's kind of crazy sometimes rallies are bad sometimes rallies are good it just makes no sense um additionally when when it comes to this people do need to pay attention when it comes to like actually like defending certain things as you can see there's another march going in there and this is the march that actually got like demolished so almost every single troop in that march actually died um oh sorry not that march <laughs> But as you can see, I'm I'm gonna show a little bit of the report right here, and then I'm actually gonna show in game the report as well. But it was just crazy. Like I didn't even expect it. Like you don't you really gotta scroll down to see the whole thing because you're like, oh, you know, you kill that many, and then you're like, oh wait, there's even more. Like you, you, I first saw this and I was like, wow, six hundred eleven thousand dead. Cool. I was like, okay, okay, I'm just going to scroll, 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 95,000. So that's already 700,000 dead right there. Um, got another 200,000 dead right there. Sorry, not dead. That was slightly wounded. <laughs> but it comes down to all the way over here, going down more, and boom, 407,000 dead right there. So anyways, guys, I'm going to hop over into the game and actually show you guys the report, show you guys some of the, uh, like the true buffs and everything. And just to show off, like basically how this, how this rally actually pulled off so many dead compared to us. So I'll see you guys in a second. Deuces. Hey guys. All right. So we're back. So I'm going to be showing off the actual report. Um, I, and I won't show off the other report. I have a couple of other reports I could show. But, is it this one? No, it's not this one. <laughs> Alright, so, where is it, where is it, where is it, where is it? I don't know why that one was saved. Here it is. So, for, for in the beginning, so we got uh, 170,000 wounded right there. Because, obviously, all the people that have the severely wounded... Oh, he healed. I was about to say, I was like, what? So, all of them that do have the severely wounded, uh, they attacked, obviously, using their marches on the side, so on the field, instead of actually reinforcing the uh, fortress, which, you know, to be fair, kind of shows, like, they just don't want to fight and stuff in a way. Uh, they just care about, like, their actual field fights and healing up their troops rather than, you know, trying to save your fortress or anything. But, regardless, uh, as you can see, Chim's, uh, Chim Diz, his Takade is only 553, five, and he doesn't actually have an expertise, but the damage he does is quite insane. So we did have 194,000 die here, but they had 611,000 dead on this try. Now, for example, I want to say this. Uh, the I know it's a Richard and a Joan of Arc that makes like no sense expertise expertise It makes no sense why a Joan of Arc uh, defense. However, they did switch it to um, From this to like a Charles and Sun Tzu and then they switched it to, to a Sun Tzu and something else and then yeah, but the report doesn't obviously do you know, obviously Say that so this person I think he didn't heal up his troops and he actually got a lot dead by himself. So this is what happens when you don't have a full hospital or you're like, for example, lower uh, power and your hospitals aren't just upgraded at all. And something like this can really screw you over, especially if you have multiple armies on the battlefield and, you know, you try and swarm a rally. It's just look at that 198,000 dead over here. So this is well over a million kills already. Uh just because of 95,000, 611,000, it's basically at 800,000 already, but that's in general almost over a million kills uh, already. And as you can see right here, Senzu Aluji, a bunch severely wounded. To be honest, when you're when you're swarming a rally, it's it's not good to do it early at all because like look at this, look at the amount of wounded you can actually get. And this is just this is just, look at that, like the difference between an actual, 
severely wounded on this side so that is crazy it can fill up your hospital immensely uh so come over here another another um march fully maxed out in getting 140,000 into the hospital that's how crazy these rallies can be when it uses attila and Takade. so come down over here 91,000 143,000 and come down here 118,000 out of 181 uh zero right there now this is the crazy bit so th this person then used sun Tzu and osman and got over 407 dead now i don't i think it was him and obviously evil weed already had people in the hospital ready so there was actually a lot of people that came in here and actually still tried to reinforce and died and it's just crazy to me i we only had up to about 250,000 dead they had well over a million dead on their side all from this fort and it just goes to show that you know fort placement is very important when it comes to past uh past five and kvk and you know you need the reinforcements you need to make sure you place it in an area it can't instantly get destroyed um unless you have like fast build and stuff and you have like everybody over there because to lose over a million kill a million troops in just over well like this took three minutes to do this it's crazy um, but anyways guys, I hope you guys did enjoy that. I I think uh, I had another flag defense here was pretty good very good uh, little you know showing off an Edward and Tomaris with uh, Tamir Tamiris Tamiris with a Richard and Yi. so it's it you definitely got to pay attention when it comes to certain things like this and It's this this was probably the best rally all kvk for me because my goodness them out dead was in this was crazy for for me obviously there's probably better reports out there but this one just wow it's crazy but i hope you guys did enjoy the video let me know what you guys think about this rally i know i wasn't the best um defensive heroes and everything however uh you just you know you got to pay attention to the fact that they did switch their commanders three times to try and put people that at least do defend and it just didn't work and they just kept switching and switch they switched about three to four times while rallying it and it's just that's something you don't do in a way but i'll uh i'll let you guys analyze this report and everything and i hope to see you guys next time have a good one and deuces oh, it's so bright it's hard to breathe but that's all right Hush.